very nearly from worst to first. They were the surprise team of 2019. Now blazing the trail at the top of the Euroleague standings, have Anadolu Efes Istanbul found the final piece of the jigsaw? First, I like to say that in the last four or five years, also when I was coaching in Galatasaray, every season I like to transfer Chris Singleton. I didn't know what I was expecting this summer. Coach here, um, he was talking to me all the time, asking me what was my move. Um, I kept telling him I have, I have no idea, I gotta figure some stuff out here. And then eventually I felt like it was time to play basketball. After a glow-trotting career in the NBA, China and successful spouse at Panathinaikos and Barcelona, 30-year-old Chris Singleton has made the move to European basketball's most improved club. He told me, he told me that uh, he wants to win the Euroleague and he believed that with this team uh, he will have this chance. I'm just trying to fit in. Um, I feel like I'm sort of a chameleon. I just fit into the role which the team or the coach should want me to. So it, it was an easy fit. Um, and I just knew it's not my team. I knew it was me and Larkin's team. So just try to come in, play a defensive role, and just do what I can. Singleton doing it on defense and on offense. He is full of experience, and you can you can feel that on the court. You can be calm that he will that he will make good decisions. So it's great to have him on on our on our team. Chris is doing amazing job, really. Uh, he is the guy who has uh, toughness for our our system. Position four is very important. He needs to spread the court very well, and he's doing that also good. He had a clutch three points against Milano, which shows that he is also able to do these kind of things. Into the second half of the season and Singleton is shooting almost 50% on three-pointers. Only superstar guard Shane Larkin betters that for the league leaders. Every time I step onto the court, every time I come into the season, my goal is to win everything. We have Cup, we have uh, Euroleague and we have Turkish League Championship. And now we're fighting for it. I mean, that, these are our goals. Overall, winning uh, motivates me and just I don't like to lose, just that's that's in life too. Like I, I always look at things on a positive side, so I think that that turns something in my head that just like pushing me to go further and do more. 